<laughs> you, Mr. Nest Camera, are my lifesaver. Do you want to know why the Nest Camera, guys, is my lifesaver? It's because it proves to you guys what I've been doing all morning. It's now sort of two o'clock in the afternoon. He said, guys, good morning. How are you all doing? My name is Alex, guys, and welcome to another daily vlog. I hope all of you guys are okay. If you're not, if you're not smiling, if you're not happy, feel free to tweet me. Drop me a message, put it down in the comment section. Hit me up on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter. It's all in the description, guys. So, guys, all morning, I have had loads of workers round in this house. Because, guys, this house is a company-built house, if that makes sense. I didn't actually draw up the plans and say, I want that wall there. This house was already planned and then what happened is that I bought the plans for it. I actually bought the house and then they built it to their specification. So guys, all of this up here had cracked. Literally all the way up, there was a huge black crack. So that guy, guys, that shook my hand, he has been in and he has fixed that. Some other little things like this unit wasn't closing properly and uh, now it does. This door handle, guys, in my lounge was super, super wobbly and now it's not. And my microwave is broken and unfortunately, uh, still broken. That's getting fixed on Friday. I make it my mission to reply to you guys, put it that way. It's something that I like to do because I know a lot of YouTubers don't do it. Now, the guy's name was Connor that messaged me, and I'm not going to give away his full name because there's thousands of Connors in the world, but he said, I really want to start making videos, but I just don't know how to get the ball rolling. Any advice? I then replied with, just do what you enjoy doing, my dude. And the reason that I'm talking about this is because Connor has literally just replied and he said, thanks bro, massive inspiration to me. Hopefully one day I can make it. Now that really, really, really touched my heart. That really, really, I don't know why, it just really did. Now guys, as much as I'd love to sit here and say that is 100% foolproof method to make it on YouTube, you know, just doing what you love, you could just do what TGF bro do and just sort of look at what does well and then copy it. It's not a dig or anything, it's just the truth. You should literally see what does well on YouTube and try and do it. And that, in this day and age, because it is so, so populated, guys, that is what you need to do. So if you can mix doing what you love and also a little bit of doing what does well, I'm pretty sure you guys will be off to a winning start. If you guys didn't manage to catch yesterday's video, guys, we, uh, well, let me put these down. So, uh, one of the main things we did yesterday was, uh, well, we, uh, we finished the desk. This looks wicked. Hello? Speaking. of old-fashioned unboxings to take care of in the new office. I really do hope you guys like the desk. I absolutely love it. It's such a vibe over in this corner. I just, I love it. It's so, so cool. The fact that there's just so much going on, but everything is just so clean. Okay, guys, so package number one. I know exactly, oh, yes. I know exactly what this is. Repairing the Cloud Key Gen 2 Plus. This thing is wicked. So guys, essentially, I've been waiting for this for so, 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 so long. This thing is absolutely awesome. It's like the entire sort of brain of my house is smart network. These things are about 120 odd pounds and they're really expensive for what they are. But as long as they get the job done and they do it well, then you know what? Whoa, this thing has got some heft to it, man. So this thing, guys, will essentially run my entire security system at my house and all of the smart devices. What it essentially does is make everything in the house 
including the network and as I say all the security stuff, super, 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 super rapid and secure. This thing's got like a two terabyte hard drive in it, as to which I'm going to take out and replace with an SSD. Because who wants a hard drive? Are you dumb? <laughs> Okay, second parcel, and I think I know exactly what this one is, too. And, uh, oh right, okay, please don't have got scammed, Alex. So what is meant to be in here is usually really expensive, and I bought it off eBay. <gasps> no, I didn't get scammed! Here they are! I got them! They work! Oh god, they're falling on the floor. So if you guys don't know about the smart lighting, guys, that I'm trying to put in my bedroom, then this is all to do with that. That goes well with this. This is looking really s This is sick, man. Okay, guys, good little unboxing haul. I think we've got some uh, stuff to go and install at the house. Some smart stuff. Smart lighting, smart house, smart amazing. Wow, I can't wait to install all of this. Let's go. Bro, mate, I appreciate it. Thank you very much. You're a star. Cheers, bud. I placed an order for a load, a load of Italian food because, well, you guys know Barney. Um, he's gone back off to Australia. He's like one of my best friends. You guys know the, well, he's called on the channel the ginger prick. That's what you guys call him. He's not a prick at all. He's a, he's a lovely guy. And so is his mum and so is his sister, which, who is coming around tonight? Unfortunately, no Barney. He's in Australia, but... Barney's mum is literally like my second mum, and I don't really ever see her enough. So, uh, yeah, Liz is coming round tonight. Uh, Liz, if you're watching, hi, I'll, I'll see you later. <laughs> and Barn, you're probably watching from Australia. Yeah, your mum's coming round tonight, so uh, let's just hope I don't mess up the food. Wish me luck, bro. <laughs> okay, guys, what do you say we're going to install some of the smart home stuff? Because I absolutely buzzing. It's literally the whole reason Luke has been at the house doing work this weekend. Okay guys, so I have been absolutely pulling my hair out for the last sort of 40 minutes and I ended up ringing Luke because I was like, I don't know why. That light isn't working. All of the other ones do work. And it's because the lights weren't in stock. That's why these two aren't quite done yet. And the way these lights have been wired in, in sort of like a circuit. So, well, for instance, if that one doesn't work or it's not wired in, then that one won't work and that one's not wired in either. But if these two don't work or aren't wired in, then that one definitely won't work because that is the last light in the circuit. So if it makes sense, it goes that one to that one, that one to that one, that one all the way around there. But at least I can demonstrate how cool this is to you. And I'm not sure if it's gonna come off on camera or not. I've messed with so much smart lighting with you guys. LED strips, wall lights, Philips Hue lights, but I've never had smart lighting in the ceiling. Right, are you guys ready for this? Okay, Google, set the bedroom lights to green. Okay, changing three lights to green. It's green! What about purple? Alright, changing three lights to purple. This is insane, like... Look at my face! <laughs> <laughs> that is absolutely brilliant. Okay, so before I put this this A7R on, I'm going to stand here with the softbox on the on the tripod. Um, it's kind of late now, and this is a photo shoot that I said I wanted to do on Twitter here. <laughs> so, Maria might get hit with a pumpkin because I'm. Wh where am I there? Because obviously I'm going to have to literally wallop it, so it's going to literally be like, I'll be really swingy. So I'll be quite far away from me because I'm going to have to, like, really go for it. Well, what, do you want the pumpkin in the middle or do you want to be in the middle? So earlier, guys, I went to the shop and I didn't vlog this because, well, I actually got really stressed out. I went to Asda, they didn't have any pumpkins. Um, so then I had to go all the way to Waitrose, and I hadn't been to Waitrose in absolutely years. But then I found four pumpkins, I got some baby ones, and. Some big ones. Yeah, I'm possibly gonna smash that ball pin as well. Oh my god, okay. Ready? Yeah. <laughs> it smashed into a million pieces.
Whoa! Okay guys, so the pumpkin smash photos turned out really, really well. If you guys want to go out and see those, they will be on my Instagram and Twitter. But I wanted to end this video just talking about a couple of things and sort of touch base with you guys. Um, I got really cold after I went out and did those pumpkin things. So I went and had a shower. Um, and then about an hour passed and I've started to feel really, really unwell and then my eye has gone all red, which usually means that I'm about to get a cold sore and I usually get them when I'm really stressed, as you guys know. Um, but there's something that I've seen a lot in, in the comments and literally everywhere, really, and possibly I, I, possibly I haven't helped this myself, um, but it's addressing sort of Maria. Um, yeah, we, we are fine. Um, I just haven't been including her in in the videos. Like we're <laughs> we're yeah, like we haven't fallen out or anything. We're absolutely fine. Um, she's in the lounge now. We're about to have a takeaway and and, and watch a scary film for Halloween. Um, but yeah, for all the comments saying that Alex uh, uh, and and Maria are broken up and they are yeah whatever they don't see each other anymore. Well, she's here. Um, if you guys would have seen, like in a lot of my Instagram photos recently, like the one when I was in the pool, you guys will see that, well, I, I commented saying that she took that photo. Like, she's an excellent photographer, she's really, really talented, she helped me with, with, with my Instagram shoots uh, and things like that. But I think it just really boils down to, and I think my mum said this best actually, something really exciting has happened in my life. But it's something that I was really sceptical to share with you guys, because, and this is just to prove a point by the way. Um, so I asked my mum whether I should share it with, with you guys, and my mum literally said, um, of course you should do what you want, you already get judged enough. And that's so true. Like, I think I share like a lot, I think I share more than, than, I should, than I should feel the need to with you guys on, on the vlog, and that's not because I feel like I have to, that's because I love doing it. But then obviously doing that, showing my entire life to the internet opens up a lot of like vulnerability for me and obviously I could make choices that or I could do things that I would like but then somebody out there doesn't like it and then they would say oh well that's not stupid, I mean, that's a stupid thing to do, I wouldn't do that. Well yeah you wouldn't do it but I want to do it. This is my life, it's not yours. You know what I mean? Like, I, I get judged enough so I'm not, I'm trying to keep Maria off this. I'm trying to keep like my my life with her off of this vlog because it's just something that I want to keep private. Like, for example, you guys see Luke um, all the time in the videos, but you see him when we're working. Like, Luke and I, yeah, Luke does a lot of work for me, but we're also, like, Luke's one of my best friends. Like, we do have friendly times together. We go out for food, we, we socialise, and uh, but you don't see that. And I would actually say that I have, and obviously you guys have seen, like, other girls in my videos, which is would lead you to believe that maybe me and Maria are finished, which we're not. I probably have more girlfriends, like friends that are girls, than boys, to be honest. Um, I don't know, I just, and I know everybody would be thinking, Alex, you're just a massive freaky nerd. How have you got girlfriends? I don't know, I just do. <laughs> like, I just, I have more girlfriends than I do lad friends, if that makes sense. Um, and my boyfriends, boyfriends are like Toby, Luke, Barney, um, yeah, I keep my I keep my group small. Uh, I keep my group, I keep the quality high. Uh, Jed, for example. There you go. I just thought I should address that. Really, I might not do a vlog tomorrow though, because if this gets bad, then I need to rest it up. But hopefully, you guys understand that, and I hope all of you are okay. Um, yeah, there you go. <laughs> hopefully, that 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 settles that. I don't want to see any more comments about me not. Not, 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 whatever, whatever you guys have been saying. There you go, I thought I'd update you all. <laughs> oh God, I'm definitely gonna be ill tomorrow, I can feel it. But guys, with that being said, look, you can literally see how bad my, my, my eye is. My takeaway is gonna be delivered in probably the next five minutes, so I'm gonna cut this vlog here, guys, and go and enjoy some time with Maria, guys. But for now, my name's been Alex, you guys have been awesome. Guys, stay awesome, keep smiling. I really hope you've enjoyed today's daily vlog, and I shall see you maybe tomorrow. Maybe not. And I did say I was going to stream on Twitter sometime soon, and I will start live streaming when, I, when I'm better. I love you guys so much. Thanks for everything. As usual, guys. Adios.